What is up YouTube? It is your boy Brant the Legendary Punisher coming at you with another video. Tonight's video I'm going to just be showing off some of the pops and an upcoming figure that I'm going to be doing in a figure review probably tomorrow. I'm going to probably film it tomorrow and it's going to be uploaded someday this week so I'm going to edit it, edit it and put a actual like a little sequence in there. Be pretty cool. But uh, first pop that I got, it's a pop review. The first pop that I managed to get today, and somehow, by the grace of God, I don't know, hell, hell must have frozen over, ladies and gentlemen, because I, for the first time in my Funko collecting career, got a mint and condition box and pop. From Walmart of all places. Walmart. Walmart. But it is the other Knight of Ren pop that I needed. The one with the arm cannon. You can see it right there. If that's the... Let me get quick out the glare. There you go. You can see the arm cannon. Arm cannon right there. See it. Yep. And side of the box the other pops in the wave but yep now I am I have them all I'm just waiting for them to arrive I just got I got the other one from the Funko shop apparently the other one decided to drop on the Funko shop today and you know your boy had to get it for his display so I picked that up and the next one also by the grace of God, I got a mint in condition pop. It is the Phoenix glow in the dark bobblehead pop from X Men, and it is an Entertainment Earth exclusive. Doing my Vanna White pose, <laughs> but yep, it's her in her green outfit. I like to call it the Lindsay B exclusive pop. I'm gonna send this to her and get Lindsay B to autograph this. And I know she's watching. She's probably laughing her butt off. But, yep. I'm definitely going to test the glow out on this. I tested the glow out on the Storm one. That thing glowed for at least an hour. So I'm expecting good things out of this. And the other thing that I got from Entertainment Earth that will be in a future review sometime this week. It is the... S.H. Figuarts Broly. Let me see if that... Yep. Yep. S.H. Figuarts Super Broly. And this is a $80 action figure, guys. Yes, these are premier, pristine, top-of-the-line figures that I collect. I have a whole bunch of them. I have probably over $2,000 worth of these damn things. But I love these... Dragon Ball figures. They are... These look like they came out of the... Um, the... Straight out of the anime. The other ones that I have on the shelf that I pose with my Funko Pops. These make them look like Happy Meal toys. That's how good these things are. And you guys will see in a future review. But... There's the side of it. There's the back of it. There's... Several different... You know... Head sculpts and face plates you can change on here... Uh, it, it's a sick figure, ladies and gentlemen. That's all I'll tell you. But, that's going to do it for the video, guys. Sorry, it was a quickie. I greatly apologize for it. But, if you liked what you saw, hit the like button. Smash the subscribe button. And hit the bell for the notifications. YouTube is crap with the notifications. But, hey, might as well hit it. But, that's going to do it for your video, guys. I'm Brant the Legendary Punisher. And I'm signing out. Love y'all.